hello everybody hope everybody's doing well welcome back to my channel and obviously it's another video of us beautifying this beautiful baby girl um for some reason i lost the footage of the um style that i did at the front so we're doing a ponytail style with a few bits dropping on the side i just come wrote uh four lines in at the front of her hair uh, just creating like a swoop and me doing the cornrows I tried curving it so that when it drops with the beads it doesn't really drop in her face and now I have basically patterned or shall I say shared the back of her hair into two so that when I do the ponytail if the pony part sits right in the middle of her hair um, so yeah, basically that's what we're doing. I'm just cornering the other side of her hair and obviously you can't see it which is really bad of me. Um, I think I'm going to start cutting this part out because you can't see the other side of her hair. But yeah, so we're just going to corner her hair and we're going to go on the other side of her hair now and we will just continue styling it like that so now i've come on the other side of her hair and i started on the corner at the top because i wanted it to match the other side and um just adjusting gabriella to do her hair obviously we're using the chair moisture curl cream to uh, corner the hair and make sure you detangle the hair so that when you're doing your cornrows um, the hair feeds in smoothly so I detangled it with a wide tooth comb and then I go in next with a smaller tooth comb and I don't use gel in Gabriella's hair so we're just using more of that uh, kids curl products to do her hair so we're just going to fast forward this part and I'll see you when most of her hair is done I'm just going to pattern the hair like I usually would uh, while doing corners in a ponytail and I'm just going to corner my baby's hair now. appreciate the beauty of this girl like I can't I can't believe she's mine honestly she sat down the whole time for this hair and I just want to show you guys the back so this is what is left at the back we're just going to corner that upwards so Gabriella wouldn't bend her neck for me to obviously do her corners which is normal she would not understand that so I just basically had to maneuver myself around her I stood up I sat down I went on one knee I went on both knees because yo like the way she was sitting for me she was sitting perfectly she did not move she was just there watching her nursery songs and it gave me a chance to pattern the hair how I wanted it without rushing and so when I conroe the hair I basically don't conroe it all the way to the ends I just conroe it to where I feel like um, I'm happy with and I just put a few more a few more plaits in that conroe so that when the hair is finished it will give it that puffy piece at the top so now that the hair is done I'm just going to tie up the um, the hair so and this is what I mean but I wanted the puffy part on the top so it's kind of like she's got a piece on 
the top of her head but that's actually her own hair so I'm just holding that now going to put our signature beads on our hair um, I basically started out with six beads um, I wanted the hair to drop really nicely and um, so I put six beads on the first strand and I think the second strand was six beads as well and then the next one was eight beads and then the next one was ten beads I did it that way so that it can create like a step ladder in her hair um, so that's the kind of look that I was going for the sheer butter mixture that I have done I'm just putting it in the scalp of her hair keep it moisturized and this is what I'm going to be doing every two days so that her hair will be nice and moisturized as well oh by the way guys so Gabriella is naked and only in her nappies because it was really really hot like it was 27 degrees or something like that so I just wanted us to chill so now that it's done we're just going to tidy up the hair she was the perfect baby I'm just showing you guys the back and I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.